Antic v. Carrington was a legal case in English law that was heard in 1765. The case dealt with the issue of warrantless search and seizure and the limits of the power of the state over the individual. The case began when John Antic, a London publisher and author, discovered that his home had been broken into by agents of the Secretary of State, Lord Halifax, under Halifax's authority had been searching for evidence that Entick had been publishing seditious literature. During the search, they seized numerous papers and documents, some of which were later used as evidence against Entick in court. Entick was outraged by the search and seizure and decided to take legal action against the Secretary of State and the agents who had conducted the search. The case was heard in the Court of King's Bench, which was at the time the highest court of common law in England. The court was asked to determine whether the warrantless search and seizure was legal under English law. The court found in favor of Entick, holding that the warrantless search and seizure was illegal and that it violated Entick's rights as an Englishman. The court stated that the power of the state to search and seize property was limited by the common law and that the state could not exercise this power without a warrant issued by a court. The court's decision in Entick v. Carrington established the principle that warrantless search and seizure is illegal under English law. This principle was later adopted by the courts in the United States and became a fundamental principle of American constitutional law. Antic v. Carrington is considered to be a landmark case in English law and its principles continue to be applied in contemporary legal cases. The case established the principle that the power of the state to search and seize property is limited by the common law and that the state cannot exercise this power without a warrant issued by a court. The case also had an impact on the development of the law of privacy. This principle has been applied in later cases dealing with privacy and has been used to establish the right to privacy in other areas such as telephone conversations and electronic communications. In summary, Entick v. Carrington was a landmark legal case that established the principle that warrantless search and seizure is illegal under English law. The power of the state to search and seize property is limited by the common law and that the individual has the right to be protected against unreasonable searches and seizures.